Dakota Cot breaks down on air after emotional coronavirus interview with Drew Brees. Today anchor Hoda Kot became overwhelmed with emotion on live television as she interviewed New Orleans Saints quarterback Drew Brees about his efforts to fight the ongoing coronavirus outbreak. Shortly after Cot wrapped up her Friday morning discussion with the athlete about the $5 million he pledged to help feed Louisiana residents, the longtime NBC talk show began crying as she reflected on one of her favorite cities as the pandemic continues to threaten lives in the vulnerable region. I also think a lot of things are contagious, including generosity. So, our hope is that because you let us know that you made this big generous donation, I think other people look and say, hey, maybe I can help out, too Cot, who lived in New Orleans throughout the 1990s, said before telling Breeze she loved him. When he returned the sentiment, Cot broke down in tears. Are contagious, including generosity. So, our hope is, is that because, you know, you let us know that you made this big generous donation, I think other people look and say, hey, maybe I can help out too. Drew, we love you. Love you too, Hoda. Okay. Thank you. All right, a lot more. Ah, oh, Hoda. I know. It's a lot. Sorry. Hoda, I'm so sorry, hon. Take a moment. Sorry. <laughs> it's a lot. I know where your heart is, my dear. I do. How about I read the tease? You yes, me please. <laughs> okay. Okay. According to the Louisiana Department of Health, the state has thus far reported 2,305 cases of COVID-19, while 83 people have died across the area. The survey indicates 676 of COVD-19 patients are currently in the hospital, with 239 of them requiring ventilators. As the pandemic spreads around the world, forcing closures of public spaces and sending global citizens into lockdown, celebrities like Kathy Griffin have recently called out President Donald Trump for lying about the United States' effectiveness in testing people for infection. For the latest information on coronavirus COVID-19, including how to protect yourself and what to do if you think you are sick, please visit coronavirus.gov.